Today is the third uh, video in the series I'm doing about JavaScript. And I'm going to talk about functions in this one. So what we're going to do, this is just a normal HTML document and I've put the script tags in there. So I'm putting this one in the head. You can put this wherever you want in the head or the body. So we're going to put uh, the name function function and I'm going to put my first first. So this is what you, you do. You put the function my first, which is the name of the function. And we do this with parathesis bracket things. And then we put this with curly brackets to open that and close the function. So what we do is we're going to do that. And I'm going to put, um, if you've followed me other videos, I'm going to put an alert and I'm going to put this and we're saying hello world again. Just the quotation marks in. Hello world. So what that is going to do, it's going to, when it's the function's going to be called, it's going to become up alert hello world. So in between the body here, we're going to have a div tag. And if you know anything about HTML, that's all it is. It's just normal HTML div. And then we do that. And I'm going to put I am a function. And so what we're going to also do is we're going to name this div. So we're going to go ID equals fun. Like that. So we're going to put, um, and we're going to do something with that later. And we're also going to put an event or what's called event in program, programming languages. An event in JavaScript can be on blur, on focus, on key down and a few others, but uh, this one we're going to use on click. And this is a very popular one uh, and you do it all the time, even if you don't know what it's called. So what we're going to do, we're going to go on click equals and it has to correspond with my first. It has to correspond with my first and parathesis brackets. So my first and the brackets. So what that does is it calls the function. If the function didn't have a, something to call it, it wouldn't work at all. So what we're going to do is we're going to call that, and I am a function, uh, is going to be changed to alert hello world. So if we just put that up, I'm going to click that. There we go, hello world. And that's what we do for that. If we just take these ones down here, so we have some space at the top and we're going to do a little bit more with this uh, div. So other things, I mean, you could have what you've, what I've already uh, shown in other ones, document dot write, uh, which if you follow the other videos, you probably be, uh, it's an easy thing to call. But what else we're going to do with this is we're going to call um, div get element by ID. And this is something that is very popular now in JavaScript and it has been for a number of years. Um, so what we do is we go a document dot get element. So what we're doing there, the element is the div, but by ID. So the ID is, is, is equals fun. So we're just going to put in up there, just get rid of this hello world thing in the mount. And the ID fun, so we put that is is quotation marks and we put fun. So we call on that by the ID and we put uh, you can put a lot of different things, there's things like style, uh, styles you can do and uh, Lots of lots of different things, uh, changing the background and changing the font color and and uh, displaying different things, but we're gonna just put in inner HTML equals, and we're just gonna put hello world. So we put that with quotations, and we're gonna put hello world. So if we uh, just load that up and see what we see what there's there. 
I am a function. Hello world. So that's just uh, a few different ways on how to use functions. You can do something like um, on mouse, oops, mouse over. And we just do that. We'll just hover our mouse over that. There you are. Do that again. Just try that one again. I am a function. Hello world. And there's there's many different uh, things about events, but uh, on click uh, on mouse over, uh, two of the probably uh, most popular. Um, and so anyway, I hope you've uh, learned something from that and. Uh, Subscribe for, for more videos and thank you for listening and thank you for watching.